Because there might be a choice, so obviously I want to create a save first. Does the game end down here? It really does feel like it's ending. Where was the e Oh, right across here. Come on down! Or up? I guess up. I guess I managed to forget what direction we came from. Right, that was the surprise at the time, is I was thinking like, are we going back up? Am I gonna access a different part of the island? And then we just went deeper and deeper down. I was like, oh, this just keeps going, huh? Yeah, there's our spectacular sight. We've made it back. Here we go. Someone might get mad at me. All right, this is a better place to save, I think. Save myself an elevator ride. Fuck, oh, okay, sorry. Oh. Oh, we're going down it. Well, that was neato. Huh. Let's head on down. Oh, that's a trip. <laughs> it's like visiting the Moaning Cavern in, uh, California. Which has a giant cast iron staircase that's all one singular welded together piece. What are you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's a new number system. Another one. Why, though, is the question. Well, might as well delete the old things, right? So we're done with you. In fact, some of these things are things I didn't... Well, I, I did need the picture of that, to refer, just to remember the numbers. It's surprisingly common, though, for me to take pictures of stuff and then never... Uh, oftentimes never have to use the pictures. Look, that's This is my only picture. Yeah, the pictures almost mattered less when we were underground. Although, in the wa underwater area, it helped me remember some numbers here and there. Saved me a trip of having to go back in. Is this just a dead end with those with those these pieces of information on them? I guess so. What are you? That's interesting. So one, we have one, two, three, four, five, but one is two. Two is one. Three is one. Four is three, and five is five. So two, one, one, three, five. That might be a combination lock. I'm not sure what it means. We could see. What is this? What are you? Teach me your secrets, weird stuff. Oh. Okay, we have a lot of combinations around. Oh, you guys. So, two. I forgot a little bit now. Two, one, one, three, five, right? So two, one, one, three, five. Did I do it? Do I do it good? Maybe that's not what I meant. Hard to say. Okay. It makes sound? Is it like a heartbeat? Okay, so maybe I need to check each of their sounds they make. This is interesting. Okay, let's check them in order, just so I can keep track. 
So that's number one. Let's reset all of you guys just about so I don't lose track. There we go. You didn't move? Oh, I move it here. Okay. Well. So number one is the two. We already saw that one, so that one was two. I'm going by this, the tempo of the heartbeat, basically. Number two is the fat crystal. What, is it, what do you do? Ah. Fat crystal's in the end. How do I interpret this? Makes one long sound. Okay. Maybe these are forward and reversed sounds? Goes around. Is it going to a peak and stopping, which would be five? Or is it going up and then down? It sounds like it's getting louder than quieter. Which would, be, which would make it two, if we're going for that. Okay. So let's make you two. I'm gonna reset you again, because I have a new hypothesis as to what go, what's going on again. So we'll try again from scratch. Sounds like it's starting at full volume and reducing in volume from there. That would likely make it four. Assuming we're even reading from left to right here in the first place. So three is the skinny crystal. Teach me your ways, skinny crystal. Yeah, that's starting at max volume and going down to nothing. Whereas this, whereas the other one was going loud and quiet. So that'd be seven. Seven is three. I think I figured this out. All right, so number four is the three crystals, which sounds like what? So it sounds like the reverse of the other one. It's two tones again, but it's going less, uh, quiet to loud twice. So eight. All right, final one. Hopefully I'm on the right track here. That's the five. One forward note followed by two reverse notes, basically. Probably has a weird shape to it. Ha. Huh. I'm not super certain. It's probably one or six. They're the really strange ones. It sounds like... Or something like that. I'm gonna go with one. That'd be my best guess. Although, isn't it already on one? I guess it is already on one, isn't it? So maybe it's already set.
It was one. Okay. I guessed all of them correctly in my first try. Well, after I had my final hypothesis at least, you know what I mean. Alright, let's keep updating my saves then. Since we haven't reached a decision yet. If there is one. Come at me, brah. Here. Had Oh yeah, Lefty Lucy, I guess. Or just open the door. No? Righty? Why is it- okay. Oh yeah, this seems safe. Exposed wires. Good for your complexion. Fun. Can you- I, I can't open you? Can I put anything on here? I st why do I still have this cut- this- this one- Why did I keep this? That is a very- the very legit skull and crossbones right there. The library. What am I playing? Stanley Parable? Ooh. John. I mean, sorry. Not John. Jose Cardoso. Let's go ahead and delete you. And delete you. I use, I use none of those pages. The Musings of an Evolved Simeon. Welcome to the Garden by Lake Cubulus. Ah. I can type something on that. Probably required. What the heck? These are the same diagrams we saw in the... I think this is the... Yeah, these are the same diagrams we saw in the power room, I think. Just in a different... Slightly different orientation, basically. Interesting. Can I combine them? I can. Okay. So I need I need to probably find a sketch to make. Black snake wham duskaspos Wham Duskasapa. It's a hell of a name. Can't read those ones. It's a teacup. These are big books, by the way. Ah <laughs> All this time and I put this here. What if I want to take it back? Wow, I brought it all the way here just to finish the set, huh? Alright, I'm down to just crystals now. Oh, lights. It's like a light to simulate the idea of having sunlight outside because we're underground. So this was his study. There's an M here. Is this the final note, perhaps? Although I was not able to fix the ancient gate's way, I managed to but Did he give up on writing? Did I interrupt him? Was he was he just here a moment ago? Lena Page Parsons, never too late. The point came where I slipped. The idea of eternal solitude tortured me beyond imagination. It even overcame my sense of duty. It made me homesick. I felt like I was suffocating. I knew that I would have to find a way to escape, but before that, I needed to do something. I wanted to reveal Quern to all worlds, to share this incredible power. At the beginning of your journey, I asked you to cooperate with me. This is the point where I require your assistance. Help me to give the worthy a chance and the opportunity to make a difference. Invenius etiam de siecti membra poete. Something like that. You would still recognize the scattered fragments of a poet. So he wants me to cooperate with him. So here's his hot wax setup. It really looks like he just took off in the middle of writing something. Like maybe I, I, I think I might, it kind of feels like I interrupted him. If you want me to help you, why are you still throwing puzzles in my way at this point? I'm not sure I'm looking at there. All right, can I power, yeah, right. Okay. How about a little bit of, uh, 
Blue light. Doesn't reveal anything at the moment. Six three two Multorum. Oh, I can't take it back out. It stays there. Six three two Fortune Maie Multorum Faber. The actual hell am I looking at right now? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Lots of numbers. 1233536. I'm sorry, 236. The only thing in the room is that guy. Let's see. I guess I might as well take pictures of all three of them, right? Let's get a nice center screen. Just in case I end up in a different room. All right, picture's taken. Multorum. Fortune mae multorum faber. Does highlighting it show what it means? No? Okay. Let's check the letters then. It may have been the description at the bottom of one of these guys. Can I tab through these? What? Okay, pressing deep- pressing the arrow keys to switch between them does not work, apparently. That was- uh, did I break it? The heck? Serum Imperator. Fortune me Multurum Faber. Artisan of my fate and that of several others. This sh- let's just re-listen to this one. This sure is special to me. The physical work I used to do here helped me calm my restless mind. Besides preventing the natural decline of organisms, the phenomenon also eliminates any need of nutrition. This means that despite the dry weather, the trees and bushes around here could easily be millions of years old. As I realize that time is no longer an obstacle, I had the opportunity to learn and perfect all of my artisan skills. This is the very place where I became a craftsman. After mastering blacksmithing and carpentry, I started to practice more advanced mechanical engineering. Artisan of my fate and that of several others. Multorum probably means several. Six three two. Is that letter number three? Six three two. I put an empty notebook right next to this letter. Feel free to take notes and draw sketches for yourself. To make you understand the extraordinary nature of this island and to clarify my deeds for you, I left a series of letters around the island. So it references, it's the, if these are the letters, then this references my, the notebook? And the letters. Am I supposed to put the notebook away somewhere? Like there? Do I add the notebook to the library somehow, I wonder? And if I do, how do I do that? And what's with this diagram here? I could try typing Multorum. That's not what I expected. So it gives me symbols. Confusing symbols, frankly.
Do I need to type Multorum? M-U-L-T-O-R-U-M. Maybe. Okay, sure. I'll give it a shot. So this one has a full outline over here, a little dark crystal thing going on here. A Y. So, it's an arrow and a Y, basically. Let's see. And it fits the diamond shape? Yeah, I guess so. So this one should fit. Not that one. Let's see here. I need this whole line here, right? It's almost there. I'm just missing this line and that line, I believe. Yeah. Let's see. That would be too many details. That's too many details. How do I get what I want? Well, that one just adds the one line. Now I just need one that adds the... This one line right here. You? Right, do you overlap everything I've already done? You do. So, arrow and Y, right? Oh, there's not supposed to be a vertical line. That one was a mistake. Arrow and Y? Yeah, so click this guy. Maybe the top one. Shit. Shit. I'm almost there. What did I use last time? Arrow and Y. Click the center one, click the top one. I think I'm wrong about what my goal is here. These don't seem to be buttons. That's an arrow. And a weird nub. Yeah, it doesn't proceed forward. That seems to indicate that I'm wrong. Six, three, two. Six, three, two. Letter six. Like... Writing number six, word number three, letter number two. That's why the U is highlighted here. Let's see here. Six, three, two. Right, yeah. That's how you get to the U. So I need U. Okay. That's the set. That's just the second symbol. So I already have it available to me now. So it's an hourglass, and then a little, little two little lines down there, basically. That works for now. Let's see here. That's it. That's it. No. That's it, right? Perfect hourglass shape. Little, two little lines. Should be you. I'll double check. Yeah. How do I confirm it then? Middle button. That one just seems to clear it out. But there's like nothing else to interact with around here. What is your secret you're keeping from me? Oh... That's just an example on how to read the freaking language thing. This is the answer. 1233. 
So that that's un that's a little too far, in that it makes it a little too confusing. So twelve three three R S S. S. Looks like that. That's a site. Okay, it's like a shit. It's gonna take a while, isn't it? Diagonal T or like a stand, basically. Ah, that's pretty much it. Just need to add you. There we go. Okay. Five, three, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, A. Okay. What did I do wrong there? Oh. I hit two of them. Okay, it's like curtains. Diagonal solid curtains, basically. There we go. We are finally on a roll. 10 2 2. Was it L? There we go. I was pressing. Forgot the hotkey for it. 10 2 2 is E. Shh. It's like a falling. It's like a triforce with an arrow pointing at it. It's weird. Okay. That's a start. That's a lot of it. Nope. Nope. That's the one. 20... 3... 6... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... C... That's not a one. Okay. Backwards K hangman thing? That's not it at all. Backwards K. Let's cross the middle. Okay. That does work. I think we're close. I just need the middle line in there. There we go. No. Let's get it back in there so I can compare it. Oh, that is the one? So how is it different? That's it, isn't it? Does that one- I probably did something wrong last time, right? Oh. No, I think that's right. I think I was slightly off last time. There we go. So that's four down. Seven, three, two. You. Yeah, I've done you before, haven't we? Hourglass arrow. Where was it? Got it. Fifteen five three. I guess I misclicked. One, two, three, four, five, three, L. That's not a one. Okay. It's like a curtain, but with a tear in it. And no outside line this time. Okay. Not like that. No outside line is the issue. That helps. That almost helps. That's it. Got it. Okay. 1319. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Another U? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's another U. Okay, just as a reminder, but I believe I know what this is. Yes, yeah, the hourglass arrow. Which one were you? This guy? Yep. Okay. Oops. 1922. M. Have I done M yet? That's not one. Okay. Yeah, that's the first one I ever tried to make. I remember you. It's the arrow Y. Okay. I'm missing... This one, I think, and that's it. There you go. Oh. So, he led you into his library. I have to admit it is truly beautiful. Sadly, it is as fake as he is. Maythorn, the archaeologist, the friend, the enemy, the savior, the wicked. It's all the same to me. It's all just the facade of a broken man whose hunger for proving himself could never be satisfied. I can only hope that by now you see this too. Yes. I think you're ready. She's coming across as a little brainwashy at the moment. Not always trusting of that.